Hello everyone, welcome to General Education. Today we're going to discuss on the third video of geometry. In the first question, we have if Z is the center of triangle ABC and AZ equal to BC, then triangle ABGC is here. In the triangle ABC, we have AZ equal to BC and we need to find out this angle BGC. So what is a centroid? Uh, we need to know what is centroid. So in the triangle, we have uh, we draw median. What is median? It is a, a line drawn from vertex to this other side, dividing this side into two equal parts. Again, well, we can draw median from here. Again, median from here. Then this meeting point of three medians is called centroid and is represented by Z. And we know that this centroid divides the line into uh, two is to one ratio. So in this uh, figure, let us look at here. This one will be 2 and this one will be 1. So 2 is to 1 ratio. Again, this BZ, this BC is uh, 2 because AZ is equal to BC. Then this one will obviously be 2. Again, uh, this median divides BC into 2 equal parts. So this one will be 1, 1 because 1 plus 1 will be 2. So again, let us look at this triangle AZ and this B. Uh, BZ and this, I'm, I'm going to say this one D. BZ, BZD triangle, we have one here, we have one here, then this triangle is obviously isosceles triangle. So, what is isosceles triangle? In isosceles triangle, we're going to have this angle and this angle equal. I'm going to name this one theta and this one theta. Again, let us look at this side. We have this side triangle Z. D, C, we have this side 1 and this, this side 1, that is also, it is going to be a isosceles triangle. So in the isosceles triangle, this angle and this angle will, will be equal, that is theta, theta. Why are, why am I taking theta? Because I'm t taking theta because this side is 1, this side is 1, this side is 1, that. So these angles will all, will all be equal. So again, in triangle, we know the interior angles of all the triangles is going to be 180 degree. So this, triangle will be total 180 degrees so for this triangle B Z C triangle triangle B Z C all the angles that is theta plus theta plus theta plus theta is going to be 180 degree that is 4 theta will be 180 degree that is 4 to the 4 for the 16 for 5 to 20 again we need to find our angle B Z C that is 2 theta that is 2 theta will be 90 degree, hence option C is the correct answer. In the next question we have in the given figure AB equal to 18, that is we have 18 here, BZ 6 centimeter and CD is 11 centimeter. If angle AED uh, equal to angle ACB, that is theta here, we have theta here, they are equal, then if find the length of side AD, we need to find this value of X, so let us start solving. Here, I'm going to consider this AED, AED is a, uh, is a triangle, again this ABC is also another triangle, so in this triangle here we have uh, alpha and we have alpha, and for this angle A, both are common, so they are going to be equal. Then lastly, the third angle will obviously be equal. There is A, B, C. I'm going to name this one theta. Again, A, D, E is going to be theta again. So uh, from here, we know that this triangle, that is A, E, D, is similar to triangle A, B, A, B, C. So in triangle A, E, D, we have... Uh, alpha opposite of alpha we have x here i'm, I'm going to solve this uh, by using the properties of similarity of triangles so opposite of alpha is x here again for this string uh, again for this triangle abc opposite of alpha we have 18 here is this one will be equal to again this side uh, opposite of theta that is in triangle a e t opposite of Theta is 18 plus 16 it is 18 plus 16 again in this triangle ABC opposite of theta is x plus 11 that is 24 by uh, x plus 11 that is x by 
18 equal to 24 x plus 11 here if we solve this uh, equation we are going to get quadratic equation that is x square so solving x square is not convenient for us so i'm going to directly put the values of uh, uh, given in the question options here and i'm going to check option a we have x is equal to 12 so that is 12 by 18 equal to 24 by 12 this 3 3 2 3 so 6 to the 12 6 to the 18 there is 2 by 3 equal to 2 24 by 23 this is not equal this is not true this is not equal so option a i'm going to eliminate option a again i'm going to say option b there is option b x is equal to 16 here there is let us put this below 16 16 18 equal to 24 divided by 16 plus 11 equal to um 2 is 16 2 9 is 18 8 by 9 equal to 24 divided by uh, 16 7 2 here yeah. 8 when the 8 3 to 24 and 9 was a 9 9 3 to 27 that is 3 3 cancel 1 equal to 1 so this one is uh, this one satisfies the equation so option B is going to be the correct option again in the next question we have in triangle ABC angle A is uh, 58 degree AB and AC are extended to the point DE respectively uh, external internal bis bisectors of angle ABC that is this this one is going to be the internal bisector of angle B again ACB this one is going to be the uh, internal bisector of C uh, at O meeting at O here while bisectors of angle external angles ADB or DBC that is DBC this is the uh, exterior bisector external uh, angles bisector again A is ECB there is ECB this this is also another bisector external bisector and what is the difference between measure measure angle O and angle P here we need to find out the difference of uh, angle O it is angle O and angle P here we need to find the difference between them so uh, we are given external uh, angle bisector so this angle bisector means another angle bisector O then what we know from here is this one is going to be the in center in center so what is in center in center is simply uh, angle bisector a point where angle bisector meets is called uh, in center also in in center there is formula so angle O angle O will be angle O will be equal to 90 degree plus angle a by 2 this angle a is 50 degree so 58 degree again this is this is for internal internal bisector formula again for external bisector we have another different uh, formula again that is angle p will be equal to 90 minus angle a divided by 2 so we need to find the difference between angle o and angle p and this difference will be equal to 2 times of angle a divided by 2 there is angle a there is 58 degree is the difference between angle o and angle p so option p is the correct answer in the next question we have in triangle pqr that is PQR we have angle bisector of angle QPR this is theta because this one is the angle bisector so this one is going to be theta again cut the side QR so QR meeting point is S uh, and S meet the circumcircle of angle triangle PQR at T if PR equal to 8 centimeter PS equal to 10 centimeter ST equal to 6 cm and find the length of PQ. We need to find this PQ. So let us start solving. Yeah, if I draw this, if I draw a line here, then this angle will be equal to this angle. I'm going to say this one is alpha, alpha here. 
in this triangle why am i taking this alpha alpha because in circle in circle properties if we uh, have a chord here and we have the angle projected here these two angles having common uh, chord will be equal theta or theta so i'm i'm using these properties so uh, this P, pq is the common chord and this angle will be equal to angle this angle that is i'm going to name it uh, alpha so let us take this triangle pqr no pqt this in this triangle and this psr this triangle i'm going to check this one we have theta here we have theta here we have alpha here we have alpha here then this angle will be equal uh, will obviously be equal to this angle because of the third angle i'm going to name this one beta i'm going to name this one beta so this triangle pqt and psr is similar that is triangle pqt is similar psr so we're using the uh, properties of sim similarities of triangles we have opposite opposite of beta we have here this triangle 10 plus 6 again in this triangle opposite of beta is we have 8 here this one will be equal to opposite of alpha we have i'm going to name this one x because we need to find out this line so x and opposite of alpha this side is we have 10 here that is 16 by a equal to a x by 10 a to the 16 therefore x is equal to 20 so option c is the correct answer here in the last question we have in triangle in a triangle a b c a d b e and c f are altitudes intersecting at o if AO is 9 centimeter, this AO is 9 centimeter and AD is 12, this one is 12, AD is 12 and this AO is 9, then this small section will be equal to 3 because 9 plus 3 is 12 and BO is 6 centimeter, BO is 6 centimeter, we have here, and find the value of BE, find the value of BE, that is 6 plus X, so now let us start solving here the question is mentioning altitude so what is altitude and this meeting point is called if all the altitudes of the triangles meet together then this point will be called ortho center in ortho center there is a formula all the uh, we have product of this one that is oa ortho center formula we have oa into od equal to OB into OE we have here OA is we have 9 into OD we have 3 here then OB we have 6 here and OE is X here then 3 to the 6 and then 9 by 2 is equal to X so uh, what we need to find out is B, BE that is BE will be equal to 6 plus X that is 6 plus X is 9 by 2 that is uh, 2 6 uh, 12 plus 9 divided by 2 equal to 9 10 11 and 2 2 is 2 1 2 2 10 to 20 point 5 10.5 so option D is the correct answer guys if you enjoyed this video please like this video share and subscribe thank you